I, I use YouTube to search for news and things, and um, this uh, writer, David Harvey, does really, really good um, just explaining geographical terms on YouTube that actually make sense, and he does good drawings and things to actually explain it, and that's a lot more like easy to process than some of the actual writing about the subjects. I would say I have increased watching videos. That includes uh, lecture recordings. All of my lectures are recorded, so even if I miss a lecture for a certain reason, I can watch it. If I'm doing a revision and there's something I don't understand, I can download that lecture, um, play it, play it on on a slower speed, maybe to to comprehend it easily, more easily. Um, I have started watching YouTube lectures, so if there's a relevant lecture on YouTube, but I wouldn't necessarily cite them as my resource. It would be as a as a background information on, on the topic, so that I get to understand a certain topic and then go from the video resources to credible resources such as article, peer-reviewed uh, journals, and so on. I wasn't really aware of uh, video tutorials or anything before second year. In first year there was nothing, and then this year I just happened to have a tutor that, um, with his suggested readings, he accompanied it with some video lectures, uh, I think they were Open University YouTube clips, and realised that actually it's a really concise, um, easy way of understanding things and getting it because it's someone telling you rather than you reading it. Um, which is actually really accessible and, and nice, um, it makes a change.